Hey everybody, hope y'all are doing good. Uh, we had a pretty cold, cold night last night. Um, I was gonna try to split some wood today for myself, and uh, got the Kubota down there running, warming up. And I was gonna use the farm track to run the splitter and try to split from the splitter and just let it, the wood go into the loader buck of the tractor. I've never done that before. But I thought I'd try it and see how it works. But the battery on this farm track, it must have lost all its cold cranking amps. It will it just won't crank when it's uh when it's cold out, so I'm gonna have to try to run some booster cables, I guess, from this BX over there to it. And see if we can get it boosted off and started. I'm curious to see how that's gonna work out. I'm sure I have to shuffle it over a little bit by hand here, but it uh, might save me a little bit of a little bit of hand work. We'll give it a try and see. Um, Bo to Bob, he mentioned doing that in one of my last videos um, about maybe building a chute or something where I could split and, and push the wood off a bank into the dump truck or dump trailer or whatever. Um, but I'm going to try this a little bit and if this works out that uh, make it a pretty good way when I'm splitting for myself just to let it fall off the splitter right into that bucket even if I don't get a full bucket full and then I can carry it up here and stack it.
I'll just take a bungee cord and tie that remote valve open. That way I get constant flow from the tractor. The hydraulics run a little slower on this tractor than they do the Kubota, but still gets the job done about the same strength. That went pretty quick and smooth. I'll uh, take this up there and get it stacked in and come back and split some more. I'm just gonna leave that tractor idling.
starting to thaw out now. It's going to be a muddy mess here in a little bit. All right, there's that bucket full stacked in here. We'll go get another one. That makes uh, three buckets. I've got room for just a little bit more. I'll probably go split enough to finish that out on up to the ceiling. And that's working decent. And then setting my bucket like this, I can just walk right out in it and uh, get the wood and carry it back in instead of stepping up and down the step, which is nice. But I guess that'll do it for this video. Uh, appreciate y'all watching. Please give me a thumbs up. That really helps uh, promote the videos. And uh, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. And as always, I appreciate you watching. We'll catch you on the next one. And thank you for all the ones that subscribed recently. And subscribed ever. Uh, without, without you all, this channel wouldn't be anything. So... Uh, you guys that watch it and comment and, and things uh, regularly, you're the ones that keep us going. But uh, we'll catch you later.